Our other top story this evening, chilling allegations against a New York doctor with ties to the Bay Area. He's accused of drugging and assaulting 13 women and videotaping the crimes. Now that doctor started his medical career right here in the Bay Area where investigators are searching for at least one victim. NBC Bay Area's Stephanie Marion joins us now. And Stephanie, what do we know? Well, Jess, we now know, as you mentioned, that Dr. Ji Allen Ching has several ties to the Bay Area. He completed his residency at the California Pacific Medical Center in San Francisco. Sutter Health has him listed as a resident that graduated from their program in 2020. And according to investigators, at least one of these sexual assaults took place in the Bay Area. 13 women allegedly drugged, violated, and videotaped. Those are the latest allegations against a New York doctor with ties to the Bay Area. From one day to another, it felt bad knowing that this happened to me. This woman says she was a patient of Dr. Ji Allen Ching and filed a lawsuit two months ago against New York Presbyterian Queens Hospital, alleging he drugged and sexually abused her inside an exam room. Now she's learning her alleged assault was videotaped, along with several other patients and acquaintances. I always say this could have been a much younger girl than me, and that feels bad. According to Queens District Attorney, the video discovery came after an acquaintance or a girlfriend found videos inside Dr. Chang's apartment showing her trauma. The DA says they also found narcotics, drugs used to sedate patients in healthcare settings, and videos of at least 13 women being raped or sexually abused. Six of the women seen in the videos have yet to be identified, and at least one of those videos was taken in the Bay Area. We know the videos were taken, not only one of them in the hospital as well, but also in Las Vegas, in San Francisco, uh, in Thailand. Um, and so it's important that people um, uh, reach out to us so that we can make the identifications. We reached out to San Francisco's district attorney's office, who says, as a matter of policy, we do not comment on the existence or non-existence of possible criminal investigations. We have yet to hear from the California Pacific Medical Center about any complaints they may have received during his residency there. We've also learned Dr. Chang was an intern at Santa Clara Valley Medical Center. The hospital tells us Dr. Chang never participated in sedating patients at their facilities. Raj. 